Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ronnie. So I figured before we jump into this updated apartment tour, I'll give you a quick walkthrough of what the space like before it was furnished. This is a studio apartment with a separate sleeping area and it is about 522 square feet. My rent is about $18.95 and that does not include the $100 parking fee and the $50 amenity fee. So if you would like to see how I decorate it and utilize this space, keep watching and stay tuned. So I completely moved this around. I now sleep in the back area. This used to be my living room. So I have my couch up here and I also have my desk where I did my makeup and stuff. That is now in the front. So here we just have the couch. No not mind that stuff on the couch. That's just a package. I need to take the work and some more of these picture frames that I want to put on this side of the wall. I haven't found the pictures I want to put in it yet so they just chilling. But yeah, this is a couch. It pulls out into like a bed. Um, I got this from Overstock. Really don't want it, but it's here for now, so we're just going to use it. It does have storage underneath. Hint, hint, if you have a studio apartment, get the couch. They got the storage underneath. Okay, save some space. And then over here, we just have this mirror that I got from, I believe this is from HomeSense. What an Ikea rug. These baskets I've been had. Those just have my little toys and some blankets. And then we turn this way to my bed area. So these pictures up here, I believe, are from Home Goods. The bed is from Overstock. Comforter, I believe it's Target. No, the comforter is from Home Goods. The blanket is from Target. And then I got these two nightstands, that one and that one, from Overstock. I just ordered this book from Amazon. I have been had that piece, so I just repurposed it. And then this is what I'm most proud of, my shelf. So this is where I used to keep my makeup and stuff, but that is now in the front. So then I just made my shelves nice and pretty. Wanna say hi, Milo? You gonna say hi? No? Okay, whatever. The bench is from, where is this from? Home Sense. And then this is what this table is looking like. Got that tray from Amazon. Vase from, I have no idea. That was a gift. And down here, I just keep some storage stuff. But yeah, this is the shelf. What it's looking like. Up close and personal. So yeah, that's this area. I love sleeping back here more. I feel like I'm not as trapped, claustrophobic. The kitchen pretty much is the same. I moved the bar cart over here in front of the fridge. So this is the bar cart. Pretty much the same. I put that shelf that was back there up here. I need to finish filling that up. So yeah. And then the bathroom, I'm not sure if the shelf was in here last time. No, I think it was the glass tables. I got rid of those. So pretty much I wanted to get rid of anything that was like silver. The kitchen was hard to do because the appliances, everything was silver, but everywhere else I tried to put more browns, more blacks, those types of things. So I got this recently to tear my product so that they wasn't just all sitting out, spread it out. And then I got this um, set from Home Goods, and then that tray came from Ikea. This also I got from Amazon, which is just like a black container for my wipes. Oh, and then this lifesaver right here, y'all. Let me tell y'all, this came in handy, okay? It's a little two tier. It fits into a really tight space holds a lot I use that to hold my cleaning products look and it fits right in this little crevice so if you are trying to maximize on space definitely go for that that is from what I say Ikea so yeah that's pretty much the same and then up here this is now my kids by Ronnie area so I did change my desk out I had the gold desk um, but to save on storage I just went ahead and got the basic youtuber starter kit desk from ikea i already had one of those drawers so i just went and bought another one and a tabletop and made my own desk but then i have this here new flower wall 
that little mini dresser because I needed more storage for some clothing. So I got that from Amazon recently. And then we have a lash bed. So if you're wondering why I got a lash bed. I took a lash course and I have intentions on doing lashes at some point. But I really, with my time, with my work and trying to do YouTube and just a bunch of stuff. I don't really have time to practice yet, but it's coming. It's coming. So right now I'm just in the practicing phase, which if I'm being honest, I really haven't had that much time to practice either. Um, speaking of lashes, my lash tech is the one who gave me this or I got this from. She didn't want it anymore, so bought it from her. And then a lot of this stuff you've seen before is just being utilized differently. I have a TV up here as well. Now you're probably wondering why do I have the TV right here because I can't really watch it while I'm doing my makeup. But when I first moved my bed to the back area, I had the living room up here. So that's why the bigger TV is back here. And then I decided I didn't want that either. It didn't work out so I put the couch up there as well with the bed. And I just never switched the TVs back. So it's just different now that you've seen before. Um, and then I just have this little desk here to kind of just, like you see, hold my purse when I come in the door. Wall's not finished. And then the closet, still the same. Super packed right now. Um, I just emptied that shelf off so I can put shoes. Because I got shoes in my car that I haven't even brought inside yet. So that's why I got this the other day to, you know, save some space. But yeah that is the studio so this is probably my third time redecorating this one not redecorating because it's pretty much the same stuff that i utilize over and over again maybe some new pieces the bed is new the couch is new i mean the last bed is obviously new that's new but everything else like the decor pieces is pretty much the same but yeah this is my kiss by ronnie studio up here love it and just a quick walk through Oh, y'all yeah, see my sign? It broke. Look at this. I need to get some glue to put that back together. I also don't know where I should put that, so. But I think what I like the best is this area. I just think it looks so cute. I'm so proud of my little shelf over there and my two nightstands. It's giving what I wanted it to give. Um, I don't know if something's missing from this area, but for now, it works out. So yeah, that's the apartment. Um. Hopefully you got some ideas so I have to decorate or how to organize the studio. This is called a, I think it's called a conclave studio. Meaning like you have a separate sleeping area. So I know a lot of people don't have that in their studio. But um, you can always put up like a divider or something to kind of separate your sleeping area from another area that you want to utilize in your apartment. So quick video, straight to the point. Just wanted to show you guys, hop on here. Um, well overdue sorry it took me a while for the furniture to come and as I mentioned it took me a while to also redecorate it and get it to where I want it to be so I think I like it now I feel like I low-key have outgrown this space and I feel like I need something bigger like an actual one bedroom apartment or something like that but I'm also trying to think about what I really want if I want to buy a house and if that is the goal I don't need to move and be paying more money because if I move I want to stay in the same complex but move into a one bedroom and it's obviously going to cost more so I'm thinking I could just try to make this work for the time being and then while I'm saving some money to get the house that I actually want or if I just want to rent I might be about that renter life I don't have to worry about nothing I might be about that life I don't know in the meantime we're gonna rock out with this if I get bored again who knows? I may be showing you another video of how I redid it for the fourth time. I'm running out of space of redoing, but we'll see what I come up with. I get creative. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? But anywho, thank you for tuning in. Um, if you're not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. Like, comment, share, all that good stuff. And I'll catch you guys next time.